Hi, in this video we're going to take a look at the macro sample and hold modulation sources. These modulation sources are only available when working in Fuser. When a synth is loaded into Fuser, you'll see two extra menus appear in the modulation sources drop down menu. The macro menu and the macro sample and hold menu. The two menus are identical except for the sample and hold feature, which I'll demonstrate now. I've got a simple drum and bass bass line here which I'm going to use to demonstrate. Now, in one of my modulation slots I'm going to load up the mono mode LFO1 which can be found on this page and there we see it oscillating away. If I go back to my synth and assign so modulation of the filter, you'll see the filter there being modulated. Now that's a fairly simple sine wave. So to make things more interesting, I'm going to replace that with the LFO1 sample and hold modulation source. What this is going to do is sample the LFO every time it receives a MIDI note on. If I play our bass line it should be fairly obvious what's happening. So we're getting an almost random filter modulation, although of course we can do all sorts of things like syncing in order to make it a bit more regular. And that's the sample and hold modulation sources. 